Alright, cool. Man's got some rubidium metal there, innit? Now this one is a mad thing. This is the second most reactive metal in the whole world. The only thing more reactive than this is cesium. And I've got a little bit of cesium there, it's golden that, you get me? But rubidium is silver still. Alright, boom. So what we're gonna do, yeah, is open up the glass ampule and get the rubidium metal out, innit? Smash, you done, no? Okay, so as soon as rubidium metal is exposed to air, it changes colour and melts into a liquid. And that's because the rubidium metal reacts with the oxygen in the air to form rubidium superoxide. And this reaction is exothermic and it causes the metal to melt. Now, as I touch the rubidium metal, we can see bare sparks in that, you get me? And what we're going to do now is react it with some water. Crazy, watch this. Oh my days fam, that was a mad thing still. So when you react rubidium metal with water, it produces rubidium hydroxide and hydrogen gas in it. That's why we can see bare smoke in the 